Well, it is uh, Tuesday, the 18th of September here, and uh, kind of starting to wrap up the corn head and to where we're going to be happy with it. <clears throat> New knives are on. They look a lot better. Uh, the corn head's going to perform a lot better. Deck plates seem to be moving pretty well. Um, squeezed out some of the bad grease out of these tensioners. And uh, they seem to be moving pretty well. Um, our last little project right now is they're kind of like a like a wear guard. Um, they're plastic, and they just bolt right on here. So um, loosen up the chain, and then you sneak three of them in, three of them in for each six a row. So we're working our way across here doing that. And um, after that, we'll tighten the chains back up where they need to be. Uh, and then we'll push grease back in. I got the Zerks off of these to push the bad grease out. Tighten them back up, put the good grease back in, the, the one stuff that uh, has no clay in it. And that should be ready to try to run the corn head. Then uh, the bean head, the crop divider, row divider, whatever you want to call this, is back on rebuilt <clears throat> after the beating it took last year. Um, we got our spare sickle here and then the other one's still sitting on top of some uh, boxes over here that we rebuilt or I think we still I think we still have to re take off all the it's 100 sections for a 25 foot head and then we'll slide it back in and then we always keep a spare just in case you either have an accident or something or just throughout the year if it gets dull instead of sitting there and changing them all you just slide it out slide the spare back in which is unbelievably handy to have um, get all this dust under the head we had an absolute freak storm rolling yesterday and the wind just ripped out of nowhere. It went from like nothing to crazy. So we're kind of cleaning up in here from that. But uh, when we can get the corn head to where we're happy that it runs, hopefully this evening or tomorrow, I'm gonna pick it up or set that down and pick the bean head up and we have, you can see it better over here. Some of the underside poly that we wanna replace. It's just getting to that point where it's pretty worn. Like you can see this is a brand new piece, but like I'm talking like these pieces that are you can't see it because it's sitting on the cart, but they wrap under, and that's what the head actually rides the ground on. So as you can imagine, that gets worn. So we got a few of those, maybe five, ten of them that we, you know, we're gonna button up. And he's got the air reel rebuilt, um, some parts to put back in though, that, so the air reel is rebuilt and ready to go. So I mean, we're we're coming together here, um, where it's gonna be pretty good here um, maybe we want to put that up maybe I don't know the air will find its way so um, but yeah other than that not much happening we got a half inch of rain out of that freak windstorm that lasted about 20 minutes yesterday excuse me and we got over six tenths this morning already and they're talking for more tonight and then they're talking for two inches of rain tomorrow and then more rain Thursday we're looking at four to five inches of rain this week so we would have liked to maybe have tried some corn today or yesterday. Well, not when we get the corn head, like we would have liked to have tried it tonight and to picked maybe thousand bushel worth so we could fill the dryer and that we could run the dryer and sure that's going to run. But uh, that's not going to happen. And uh, there's some rumors that the, the moisture is way down on corn. Our beans aren't ready. Some guys are picking beans in the area. They must have early maturity. I don't know, but our beans aren't there yet. We'll be picking corn first, I'm sure. But uh, yeah, but uh, yeah, that's pretty much all that's going on this week, guys. Is just uh, more uh, wrenching on stuff here, getting things cleaned up, dialed in, greased up, serviced up, and um, that'll be the whole week. So that's just kind of a weekly update. Uh, stay tuned. Uh, when harvest kicks off, you know, I'm gonna try to get. You know, uh, I don't know if I'll necessarily get like a daily video like I did last year, unless people like that. I might try to do a little bit better job of editing and kind of uh, different steps of different things. But we'll see see how things go. Maybe I'll be able to do a daily video. Um, but uh, between this and the bean head, that'll be the next couple days of work. And uh, by then, I'll be ready to go back to work for the weekend. So thanks for watching, and uh, be safe. We'll check you guys later.